myself is cl ratod assistant professor department of mechanical engineering walchand institute of technology solapur today's topic is orthographic projections of simple object learning outcomes at the end of this session student will be able to draw the orthographic projections of simple object this is the simple object so this is the from this this is the front view and this is the top view and this is the side view so when we see from the top so this portion is going to visible to us and and when we see from the top this slot is going to visible for us and this slot so first what i have to do so i have to write down the length is equal to 125 and width is given that is 50 mm and height is given that is 40 plus uh, 20 is the uh, dimension is given so for that i have to take 50 is the 50 mm is the height now what i have to do i have to take the reference line so this is the reference line so this is the x and y this is the x dash and y dash now what i have to do 125 i have to take so i have to take 125 this is the 125 and then and 15 mm block is given so i have to take 15 mm from this this is the 15 mm and what i have to do so at 40 mm i have to take the axis line from this i have to take the 40 mm and i i will going to divide this from this point i have to take 50 50 at 25 i have to take one axis line and i will going to draw the axis line so this is the axis line at 25 and so 15 mm from this i have to take 15 and i'll going to draw this block so this is the 15 mm block i have to draw and from this 40 so this is the 40 mm from this from this i have to take 40 mm and i'll going to draw the one axis line and i'll going to draw the one axis and i'll going to take 50 is the radius is given so 25 i'll going to take the half of that and i'll going to take the 25 so from this i have to take 25 and i'll going to draw this block and i'll going to project this up to this now when we see from the top from front we are not going to see this hole so we have the dimension it is given 25 from this 50 mm is the uh, width is given and what i have to do i have to take from this axis i have to take 50 mm so from this axis to this axis it is given 50 mm i am going to take 50 from this and i am going to from this what i have to do i have to take 25 from this then from this i have to take 25 then i am going to draw the axis line so i have to take uh, i have to draw the axis line uh, near this is the axis line i have to take and and on both side its dimension is given 15 mm so on both side i have to take 7 mm 7 mm both 7.5 7.5 
by both sides. And I'm going to draw the dotted line for that one. So because when we see from the front, we're not going to see that hole. Then, so when we see from the top, we'll going uh, front, we're going to see this hole. So for that, it is given 20 mm is the diameter. So I'm going to take 10 mm and I'm going to draw the that complete circle. Then, so this is how we're going to draw the our front view. So now what I have to do, I have to project all this line. So this is the axis line I have to draw and this is another line and also I have to draw these lines. And now what I have to do, I have to prepare the 125 by 50 mm block and I am going to draw the top view from this. Now what I have to do, I have to divide this 50 by half then 25 I am going to take and I will draw the axis line here. And then, then what I have to do, when we see from the top, when we see from the top, we're going to see this slot, this slot, and this surface, and this hole. So for that, I have to draw the uh, this hole. And when we see from the top, we're not going to this hole. So for that, what I have to do, I have to draw the dotted line through this. Then when we see from the top, we're going to see this complete edge. Then for that, I have to draw the dark line. And similarly for this also, I have to draw the dark line. And here also I have to draw the dark, dark line. And one thing wha what I have to do, here I am going to, and I am going to take this and I am going to complete the dimensions. Now what I have to do, I am going to mention the dimensions. So this is the 125 and pause the video and see the dimension given from center to center. I hope you got this. So now this is the dimension is given. this dimension is given this whole dimension is 25 and this dimension is given from this it is given radius of 25 and this block dimension is given 15 mm and another dimension is given that is uh, 50 mm this dimension is given. So this is how we are going to draw the top view and front view of this simple object. Thank you.